What up, Joe Fresh Day son? Feels good to be home. I'm just gonna be chilling today. I know it's Friday night, should be going out, partying, hanging out, but I feel like chilling, eating Chipotle, watching cartoons, um, doing things like that today. But we, and also we have to get up super early tomorrow because we're gonna be meeting all you guys at the walk, or you guys have already met you if this video goes up. But yeah, we're gonna meet you guys at the walk. We gotta be there like 8 a.m., but drive to Philly, so we gotta be at like 6 a.m. And I'm not a morning peep, not at all. So I'm just gonna chill today. So uh, so what do you guys wanna do? You guys wanna play? Yo, Grand Theft Auto comes out tomorrow. Hell yeah, son! What up, peeps? I am at the copying store, and I'm getting these things printed up for the walk tomorrow. I had only like four left from last year, so I'm getting some made, and I don't even know how many to make, because I don't know how many of you guys are actually gonna be walking tomorrow. It's like, I'm not able to check. It's kind of difficult, because so many people signed up for the walk, but they're not actually gonna be physically be there. They might not be able to cut them for me in time for tomorrow. So she was like, she saw the paper. She's like, well, it's a team. You should have your t each, everyone in your team grab a pair of scissors and cut them. And I'm like, well, I'm the leader of the team, so I kind of have to do it myself. It was funny though, because she, she didn't understand. But I told her it's for a charity walk, and she's like, oh, that's nice. Typical cat, you put something on the floor and that's what they sit on. Does any of your cats do that? As soon as you put something different on the floor, that's what they want to be on. That's, it's true. I don't understand why cats are like that. The last night, you guys don't know this. I wish she, Gina would have filmed it, but she was sleeping. I kind of remember too, which is weird. And we, I just was reminded because Gina was like, Yo, your game is sticking out of the Wii. Like, it's just hanging out. Because last night, I woke up and I slept walk and I jumped up. You, he said he'd slept walk twice. Yeah. I remember the one time. I remember both. I don't remember you I woke, well, the first time I woke up and I was in your purse. No, the, okay, so the beginning of that story, but you might not remember, he's like, he woke up, he's like, oh, come, come on, come on, stop, don't prank me, don't prank me. He thought I was gonna prank him. And he gets up out of bed and, he, and my pocketbook was on the floor. So he's like looking in my pocketbook and I was just laughing. And I Yo, went, I don't know I what like, I was, I don't know what I thought about what was in your pocketbook, but I remember that. Yeah. And then again, I woke up again, I ran out here. I, I don't remember running out here, but I remember like pushing eject on the Wii U, turning the Wii on, and then I shut it off. I was like, oh, I'm sleepwalking. So weird, does anyone get, I don't get it. Like, I wish I could remember why I jumped up originally, and I wish Gina would have filmed me jumping I up. I know you did. I know. Ella is like so fascinated with this laminating. Look, look at her leg. <laughs> look at her leg. She just won't leave it alone. She's like so interested in it. Look. I see it, I see under. it. I see her leg. If you guys didn't know, Gina's cutting out all the, uh, I'm trying to. Every I know. <laughs> she can't do it. Baby, who keeps bothering her? Watch. Watch. Stop! <laughs> Every cut I try to make, he jumps on it. Stop! <laughs> Stop! Come on, boo-boo. He's, if any of these are crooked tomorrow, it's his fault. Or maybe Jesse will help me, and then those will be crooked, too. I don't know, but why are you laying on the floor right there? <laughs> <laughs> Why would you step on my rib cage? I stepped on your belly. Get off of that computer, Bambino. Okay, peeps. For the last six months of my life, I've been coming up with this plan. I think it was longer, babe. It's probably longer. But this plan to develop the biggest prank, including you guys, that we've ever pulled ever. And this is it. I'm going to reveal the plan to you guys because it's now time to set it in motion for it to work. I'm so excited for this. Finally, it's here. So, I'm sure you've seen like earlier today, I posted a video, Chip Chocolate Hates Fruit. And you're probably all like, what the hell was that all about? So, Chip Chocolate is a character that I developed, kind of like Sasha Baron Cohen developed Borat and uh, his other characters. But it's a character, right? You guys, why this includes you guys is, you guys are so big. The Dope Fresh Nation got huge, like bigger than I could have ever imagined in my life. And I was like racking my brain, like how can I use a lot, utilize the Dope Fresh Nation to do something crazy to kind of change just the world almost. And I developed this guy, Chip Chocolate, because of the cookie dance and how much you loved it and it was just the right setting. You guys have the power to make somebody famous. You guys do. Chip Chocolate is the most ridiculous character ever. That's the point of him. He's super douchey. He, we're making fun of the rap game today. All you guys know, like all these rappers that rap about money and cash and girls. Well, Chip Chocolate raps about cookies. So the music industry is gonna be like, who the hell is Chip Chocolate? And once Chip Chocolate starts getting popular, then I'll never break character. So if people wanna meet me, I'll stay Chip Chocolate. The Chip Chocolate character is so fun to play with. He's this mad ratchet character and we're making fun of all the hip hop people today so because I know it was a lot of information and I told it really fast and 
I know, I hopefully it made sense. But so, Chip Chocolate made a song, it's called The Cookie Dance, we're going to be releasing that later this month. And you guys, we're going to prank the music industry, you guys are going to help me do it. We're coming for the rap game, we're going to be sprinkling cookies on everything, we're going to be making Ellen do the cookie dance. That's what we're going to do. You guys have the power to control the music industry, and how freaking hilarious would it be if Chip Chocolate is like ranking with, with big artists? So hopefully you guys understand, I will definitely keep you posted every day until the launch. I'm shooting a music video for the cookie dance at the uh, end of the month, so that will be launching too. This is gonna be crazy. This is gonna be the biggest prank we ever pulled, the Dope Fresh Nation. I would have been wanting to share that with you for so long, but hopefully it made sense. But it's the first time I revealed it to you. I'm super nervous, I hope it works, and that's it. We gotta get up so early tomorrow for the walk. All I did today was edit that chip chocolate video you watched that was posted I think earlier. It's so dope. Yeah, tell me it's if you like it. Make sure you go over there and show cool love and uh like write, you know what you should do? Go over to that video and write like Chip Chocolate is the best rapper. Just, you know, this will get stir we're gonna stir this thing up, man. Cookies. <laughs> Alright, peeps. We'll see you guys tomorrow. We gotta do them for And I'm really proud of you, babe. Thank you. Thank you. I know, so I've been going ham. Like months and months. Almost like practically a year yeah. now. Almost. So uh we're gonna go to Varian Cancer Walk tomorrow. We'll see all you guys out there and we'll see you tomorrow. Peace. You'll fly with that?